City officials in East Lansing broke ground on Tuesday for construction on their next high-rise building to begin. That building will be an MSU Federal Credit Union. Thank you for allowing us to be part of this. Thank you very much. While this development is new, MSU FCU has been part of the community since 1937. And we prior to that building, wanted to be in the core of East Lansing. It just wasn't possible 15 years ago. It is possible today. And this 81,000 square foot building is underway after breaking ground on Tuesday. Providing office space in the city, creation of a new intern center, and providing a community room for our community, both for East Lansing and the university. The goal of the project? To help members achieve their dreams. To help members achieve their dreams. And to bring more jobs to the downtown region. We will house in this building our intern center, which generally employs around 30 students each semester. Our financial education team. Mayor Aaron Stevens says with the addition of more jobs means more foot traffic downtown. Growth is necessary, especially after coming out of a pandemic. Our businesses have been suffering already. And the truth is that that in influxion of extra people that are always walking around, that are always in the area, means that we don't have to put the same amount of effort into getting people into the downtown because they're already here. The credit union will be built next to Dublin Square's outdoor patio. Dublin's owner brought up concern at previous city council meetings regarding overhang from construction equipment. The council approved demolition of two houses and an apartment complex to address the concerns. Construction is expected to be complete in March of 2023. This building will join a whole host of new high rises that have recently joined the area, including Newman Lofts, the Abbott and the Graduate Hotel. MSU FCU will stand at seven stories high, bringing the height close to what those buildings are around it. Reporting in your neighborhood of East Lansing, Michaela Temple, Fox 47 News.